Do you know one of the easiest ways to get new customers into your doors? Well, be outrageous and different from everybody else. Times are tough these days and there's more competition than ever before. You can't just be good or average anymore. You must go out above and beyond to grab attention and stand out and stay ahead of your competition. Give people a reason to choose you over everybody else. I'm Nick Fosberg and you're watching Bar Restaurant Success, the place bar and restaurant owners visit to discover how to get ahead in business and in life. And today I'm gonna to give you three outrageous restaurant marketing ideas that you should try this year to stand out from the competition and win over brand new customers. And as a bonus, I'm also gonna tell you how to get thousands of dollars in free advertising with these promotions too. Now the first restaurant marketing idea is a food eating competition. Now you might be saying, you know, Nick, this isn't a restaurant marketing idea, it's a promotion. And yeah, you're right, but soon you're gonna see how all these promotions are going to top into one key strategy to bring you hundreds of new customers based around one simple tactic. So why run a food eating competition? Well, because people love to be entertained, it's different, and nobody else is probably doing this in your area right now. I mean, you can go to any bar, you can go into any restaurant, eat, drink, watch the game, but I mean, how many are doing fun, crazy things like this? Not many. I run a pizza eating competition, a one pound burger eating competition, and a taco eating competition once a year, every single year, and my customers love it. I tried hot dogs in the past, but didn't work out. Nobody wanted to eat hot dogs, so just keep that in mind. But if you are gonna try this out, ask your customers what they'd want first so you get the best response. Now the second restaurant marketing idea is running a contest and giving away a free meal per day for an entire year. Why do this? Well, it's an amazing offer, it grabs attention, and who doesn't want to sign up for a free meal per day for an entire year? Now, are you going to lose money running this type of promotion? Not one penny. And here's exactly how I run this. Set up a one-page lead capture website to collect people's information in order to sign them up. Drive traffic there using Facebook ads and getting your staff to sign people up in-house. And to make this really profitable for you, make everybody a winner by giving them some kind of discount when they sign up and then give them seven days to use it to create some quick sales and get them in your door. But what I do for the winner who wins the free meal for a year is I tie restrictions to it where it's dine-in only. They must either purchase two beverages with, uh, with the meal or they need to buy a full price menu item. And I make this very clear at the beginning so there's no confusion, but by adding these restrictions, you at least break even with each meal. Now the third idea is to get a celebrity chef to come in. Why? Well, everybody wants to meet a celebrity and this helps you build instant credibility. And the way to start looking for someone who isn't really you know, that expensive, look for the chefs that are on Bar Rescue or one of the other food TV shows and contact them to see if they, you know, what they charge to come in. And maybe get some of the beer, liquor, food vendors to help sponsor it. But here's the big bonus I really wanted to fill you in on. When you run outrageous restaurant marketing ideas like this, you don't have to come out of pocket to promote them. You can use the press. All you have to do is send out a press release about the event, and if you don't know how to write one, Google it. I mean, you can get a template right away, and you can write this thing in 20 to 30 minutes at most, have a manager do this for you, it's easy. So take that press release, send it out to your TV, radio, news stations, and they will interview you before the event and you will get exposure that way. Then most likely they will show up the day of the event and get even more footage and you'll get, again, more exposure absolutely free. So this brings me to my conclusion. In today's competitive market, you have to run promotions and marketing strategies like this. You have to be different than everybody else and you have to stand out because if you don't, you'll never reach the success you're really looking for. So stay with me each week and I promise that I will keep delivering you with new strategies and promotions to keep you one step ahead of the competition. If you have any questions, comments, anything, please, please leave them below and I'd be happy to answer them. We'll see you on the next episode.